Welcome. I would like to take a few minutes to show you where and how chemotherapy is provided for patients in the Frederick and Medical College of Wisconsin Cancer Centers. We offer multiple convenient locations where you can receive chemotherapy. The staff, both nursing and pharmacy, follow the same policies and procedures at all locations for your safety. They are required to meet the same education and ongoing training from their professional organizations, the Oncology Nursing Society and the American Society of Clinical Oncology. They also adhere to the same professional standards of practice. Chemotherapy can be an overwhelming experience. We'd like to help you prepare for your appointment with us. In the next few minutes, we'd like to give you a virtual tour of what our infusion area looks like. We hope that this tour will help you understand what to expect during your visit. Your clinic nurse will have given you information on any drugs you need to take before arriving at your infusion appointment to prevent side effects such as nausea. They will also have educated you on the chemotherapy you will receive in the infusion areas, including side effects and any special precautions you may need to follow. They also will have advised you of any restrictions for the day of chemotherapy. If you have any questions about that, please call your clinic nurse. The phone number is located in the information given to you at your first clinic appointment with your medical oncologist. Please eat as you normally would before coming. We ask that you bring an adult family member or good friend with you to your first appointment. There will be a good deal of information shared and four ears are better than two is really true. We do ask that small children do not accompany you to the infusion areas unless you have spoken with staff members about it ahead of time. What should you bring? Snacks and a good book are welcome. Cable TV, DVD, and VHS players are available in each patient cubicle. There is Wi-Fi access, so laptops, tablets, or cell phones are all welcome. Water, juice, coffee, and light snacks are also available. Your first stop will be at the front desk. You will be welcomed and greeted here by staff. You will receive an armband to wear while you are here. For your safety, the armband will be scanned prior to each medication you receive to ensure that you get the correct medication every time. After you check in, our nurses and pharmacists will be double checking your orders and preparing the drugs your doctor has ordered for you. This process is very detailed to assure you safely receive the right drugs and the right dose. Chemotherapy drugs are not made until you arrive since they are dosed just for you. Depending on your chemotherapy regimen, it can take up to 30 to 60 minutes for the entire process of preparing the chemotherapy. The drugs are prepared in our cancer pharmacy under sterile conditions by staff who are specially trained to mix and prepare your drugs. Only cancer medications are prepared in this area. Our pharmacy is a state-of-the-art environment to assure your safe care. While you wait, we suggest that you check out other areas of the cancer center you are in. Many of our sites include small stones wellness centers and a small library where you can browse around and find great resources. At Frederick Day Hospital, you can also ask for a pager and leave the area. As you return to the front desk, return the pager and a tech or a nurse will greet you and bring you back to the treatment area. If needed, you may be asked to step over to a scale for a weight or height check. We will need to check your weight if one has not been done and recorded in the last 21 days and your height if it has not been done in the last 12 months. Your correct current height and weight are necessary as it decides the correct dose of your chemotherapy. We are very careful with our calculations. All areas have similar setups designed for patient comfort and safety. Assignment to a chair or bed is based on patient needs and availability. We also offer many clinical trials. If you are on a clinical trial at Frederick Hospital, you may have your treatment in our translational research unit where nurses and pharmacists collaborate to provide you state-of-the-art research opportunities comfortably and safely. Now it's time for your chemotherapy. A nurse or a tech will help you get settled. A registered nurse with special training in the administration of chemotherapy will be caring for you. During each visit, the nurse will ask you questions about how you are feeling physically and emotionally. An IV will be started or your central line, like your port or pick, will be accessed if it has not been done so already. Two nurses will be verifying your chemotherapy for the correct drug, dose, and time. When giving chemotherapy, the nurse will be gowned and gloved to protect them from any accidental contact they may have with the chemotherapy. You will see lots of protective equipment for handling and disposing of the chemotherapy equipment. 
It is for everyone's protection. You will not be asked to wear any special protection. Remember, the chemotherapy you receive is helpful in treating your cancer, but it can be harmful to those without cancer. When you are done with your treatment, you can usually resume your usual activities, but don't forget to take care of yourself, eat healthy, drink water, keep moving, and get plenty of rest. Thank you for taking the time to review our infusion areas of the Freighter Health System. Please let your clinic nurse know if you have any questions.